Hello YouTube and welcome to Destination Lego and welcome to a much requested video. So today I'm going to be sharing my entire, or thereabouts, collection of unopened Lego sets. So let's get straight into this video because I suspect this is going to be quite a long video. So what we can see in front of us first off is starting with Lord of the Rings. So I'm just going to go along. I'm not going to call out any particular set at this stage. So where you can see a stack like that, that is we have multiples of that set. Okay, moving over to the other side we have the Hobbit. And again, a couple of stacks there. Over into monster fight, monster fighters. And now over into the Lone Ranger. Okay. So now we're about to go into this lot. Oh, there's a, my little Alper Ethan. So, where should we start? Let's start with my biggest part of my collection, which is Star Wars. So, as you can see, lots and lots, and in some cases, lots and lots of multiple sets. So, battle packs, quite a few. So, Elite Clone Trooper and Commando. Droid Battle Packs, as you can see we've got quite a lot of those. Geonos and Cannon. And up here we have the Corporate Alliance uh, Tank Droid. So all oh, that stack going down there is those. We have the AT-RT. Stack of those. We do have some of the older ones as well. More Battle Packs here. And again here. Okay, we have the X-Wing Starfighter. I'm just going to be seeing a few of those. I think there's six of those there. And then down below my feet here. Okay. TIE Fighter, three of those there, ATTE, three of those, Jabba's, Jabba's Sail Barge, three of those, Rancor Pit, two of those, Sith Fury Class Interceptor, got one of those there, working our way down now. Again, multiples of some sets. And we have here the. Which one is this? The. Advent Calendar, but which one is this? We're going the wrong way. The 2013 Advent Calendar, five of those, I think. And we've got the 2012 Advent Calendar. Battle of Hoth game. Jabba's Palace. Millennium Falcon. Gun Gun Sub, a couple of those. The Malevolence, Gold Leader's Y-Wing Starfighter, so that's most of my Star Wars apart from, we'll work our way around first, we have a box of Mixels there, this box here has got some of my rarest sets in there, um, okay, moving back, some of the UCS sets, Republic Dropship, dropship with the ATOT. Awesome set, and that is unopened, brand new. Obi Wan's Jedi Starfighter again, USC. We have R2 D2, two of those. We have the Imperial Shuttle, B Wing Starfighter, Red 5 X Wing Starfighter, so they're all UCS sets. We've got the Monster Fighters house there, mansion. We've got the V. v 
VW camper van. Wow. Moving around. Right, in these boxes, I'm not going to get them out, but we've got a no, uh, sorry, a Superstar Destroyer in that box, brand new. And we have a Death Star in that box, both brand new. Um, on top, we have some of the Minecraft sets. As you can see there, I've got another Death Star there. So that one's for me to be built. Those two are to be kept, they're investments. Um, I've also got a Starfighter, uh, sorry, a um, Superstar Destroyer which is already built. Other bits and pieces on the top there, LED lights, we've got some books, I've got more books as well than that. Yeah. Okay, so now so on to some of the modular buildings, Palace Cinema there, the Parisian Restaurant, um, Pet Shop down there, Town Hall. That one, which the name escapes me, can't remember what it is. We've got the train. Really tall. Right, some Lego movie sets down really here. Really tall. Uh, really tall. We've got Metal Beard Sea Cow down there. The huge set. We've got Benny's Spaceship, Spaceship, Spaceship. Some more Lego movie sets there. We've got Lego movie pens, retractable pens down there. Some Chima stuff in here. Um, we've got some road plates and base plates there. A couple of Technic sets for me to build. we got the uh, fairground mixer. Okay, these bags here, I'm not going to get everything out, but these bags are full of uh, various things. We've got uh, Hero Factory stuff in there. We've got some of the old planets, Star Wars planets. We've got some, some of the little minifigure city sets. We've got Chima stuff in there. This bag here is full of minifigures. Collectible minifigures, rather. So, Series 11 there, we've got Series 10, all sorts in there. Let me go to this one to show you, for example. Series 10 is in there. So, that bag there, full of those. Uh, some of the Halloween sets there, three of those. Okay, so carrying on moving around. Say hello, Ethan. Hi. <laughs> well, you got some of the castle sets there. A couple of those ones. How uh, many of those? Five of those by the looks of it. Right, now over on to, let's get these creator ones first. Some of the creator sets down here. That one I've only just got. The cafe and bike shop. More creators. Right, then over on to my Lego City sets. I've got quite a few Lego City sets. All brand new unopened. And hopefully one day we'll go into my Lego City. Obviously apart from that, well bits of it will. It's an advent calendar. Okay, well we're there. We've got some of the um, mini figure mini figure display cases, red and black. That box there again is full. Of smaller sets and minifigures and polybags to be built and reviewed. Uh, more Lego City sets here, multiples. There's three of those there, two of those. Okay, if I take this back this way, train tracks, a couple of each of those. Working round again, we can see multiple sets. About six of those, I think they're all there. Okay, back round to this middle bit and working up. And up the back there, more sets. Some other bits over there. Still haven't got that opened up. We've got a full box there of Lego Simpsons minifigures. Some more city sets there, more city sets there. Up on my table here, again, some of my latest stuff the Ultra Agents. Okay, so I think. I think that's about it. Well, as you can see, I'm trying to find something to step here without. Um, breaking anything or crushing anything as you can see I do have quite hello again 
quite a large collection of unopened sets. So, I have a question for you guys. My collecting has got out of hand, as we can see. Yes. And I have pretty much run out of room. So, certainly where I've got multiple sets, I now believe time has come for me to part company with some of these sets. So, what do you think, guys? Um, Bricklink stroke eBay. Um, I probably buy most of my things, uh, my certainly my second-hand things from Bricklink. Um, I guess the question is, do I sell these sets? So if I go to some of these sets, for example, do I sell them whole or do I part them out? Um, so this is probably one of the first ones I'm going to do. These ones where I've got absolutely loads of them. Do I sell that whole? Do I wait a bit longer? Wait until it's discontinued? Do I part that and sell it now? Same over there with those. These ones are getting a bit harder to get now. Um, but these batter packs, do I sell them now? Do I wait a bit longer until they're even harder to get? Do I part them out? Do I sell them whole? Um, the X-Wing, same question really applies um, for pretty much all these sets, but certainly where I've got multiples. Um, and some of these, so like for example, a lot of these Star Wars I've built and reviewed already. So I've already got one of those built. Um, in fact, I can show you that. So there's three there. If I go over to my display here, we can see him there. So here's some of my display actually. Looking extremely e dusty. Ewok Village. Yeah, my take on the Ewok Village. It's not just the Ewok Village, it's got obviously other sets in there as well. But <laughs> apologies, very, very dusty. <laughs> that really does need cleaning. Um, anyway guys, hopefully you have enjoyed this video, it has been requested um, for some time now. So this video is going on now for getting on for just over 12 minutes. Um, but yeah, there we go. If you have enjoyed it, please do go ahead and give it that thumbs up. If you haven't, let me know why you haven't. Don't just give it the thumbs down. I don't mind you giving it a thumbs down, but let me know why, so that I can improve. Um, let me know your thoughts but please let me know what you think I should do with this lot obviously apart from building and reviewing the ones that I haven't done so already um, but like I said Britling, eBay, part out sellers complete sets let me know anyway guys like I said thanks very much um, yeah that's it so what do you think Ethan? good good yeah Brilliant. Anyway guys, thanks very much and hopefully we will see you in the next video. I very much doubt I'm ever going to do one of these again because as you can imagine this has taken me ages to get this lot out. Oh, I've got another one now. I've got another little helper. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> That's my son, Kian, um, who's only two, two and a half. Um, anyway guys, that's it. Sorry to keep going on and on and on. Um, comments, thumbs up, share the video. Um, and if you haven't done so already, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel, or shall I say our channel. What is it called, Ethan? Destination Lego. Destination Lego. And I look forward to seeing you all in the, the next, next video. Cheers. Cheers. Say bye. bye. Say bye.